I always knew my heart was with the cows. When I was five, I started showing, and I've only ever missed one year of showing at our Bloomsburg Fair. It's just kind of in my blood that my dad really instilled in me the love for agriculture and the dairy industry with milking cows and obviously the brown Swiss. <laughs> Just growing up, we were always in the barn. That's our livelihood and that's how mom and dad were making a living and so that's where we were too. As we grew up, we just got more and more responsibilities. I remember as a toddler, my brother and I used to run around on the John Deere tricycle and have races and we might have fell in the gutter once or twice. <laughs> I went and graduated from Penn State. I went for agricultural sciences. I lived at the dairy barns a couple summers and learned a lot. <laughs> I brought a lot back to the farm here uh, and I think dad was pretty proud of that. So in high school, I received a scholarship my senior year through FFA and I had to write an essay to receive this scholarship. I wrote down I wanted a barn full of excellent brown Swiss cows and different things. And when I opened my store in December, the gentleman that gave me the scholarship reached out to me and he says, Jenny, I have to say I dug out your essay. I read it. It's exactly what you're doing right now. So you have a barn full of brown Swiss cows and you're fulfilling your dreams. I got a little emotional with it. We milk our cows every single day, morning and evening. And when I process, we take it right out of the bulk tank from that milking and bring it down and, and bottle it that day. So it's as fresh as you can get. <laughs> my pap and my nanny were both very, very active in our lives and they were very, very supportive of us. I was pap's girl. He was a chocolate milk connoisseur. So it was mid-December that I made my first batch of chocolate milk. And so I made it in honor of him. So Nanny and I got a glass of chocolate milk. She was the first person to try it. And we took a picture with his picture and we made that and I made a post about it and I actually had someone not even five minutes later <laughs> run in the store. She's like, I have to get this because of that story. <laughs> Which was very touching too, that she was like, I, I really felt I needed to come get some of this chocolate milk because of your pap. He's always with us and watching and supporting. I guess I get emotional because I fill up with pride. I am proud of myself. I'm proud of my family for continuing to have faith in me to do this. Thank you.